In this video, I'm going to show you how to classify quadrilaterals based on their attributes. In the first example, the polygon has four sides and four angles, so the polygon is called a quadrilateral. Next, we'll look to see if there are any sets of parallel sides, and there is one set of parallel sides which we can see from the arrows on the top side and the bottom side. This means that the top and bottom side are parallel to each other. Because there is one set of parallel sides, this is classified as a trapezoid. Because there's only one set of parallel sides, it is not a parallelogram, and therefore it is also not a rectangle, rhombus, or a square. In the second example, the polygon has four sides and four angles, so it's classified as a quadrilateral. There's not just one, but there are two sets of parallel sides. Having at least one set of parallel sides allows us to classify this as a trapezoid, but having two sets of parallel sides also lets us classify this as a parallelogram. There are four right angles, which makes this classified as a rectangle. There are also four congruent sides, which makes this classify as a rhombus, as well as a square. In the third and final example, we're going to take the polygon listed at the top of the slide, and we're going to list its attributes. A rectangle has four sides and four angles. It also has two pairs of parallel sides. And finally, it has four right angles. We're going to delete the last text box because we don't need it.